Welcome to volume three of the cash flow series. This volume is about how to supplement your cash flow, brought to you by Briefcase Essentials. My name is Susan Spencer, and today we will be talking about some very serious issues, ones that involve some measure of risk for you as a woman in your own business. Borrowing money. Growing your business by borrowing money is a part of being in business. And without it, your business will be very small and probably unfulfilling. Considering all of this effort you're putting in, time and effort, to make it successful. So take a deep breath, believe in yourself, and let's talk about borrowing money. I have listed all of the basic options to supplement your cash flow on the chart. First, you should consider a line of credit or a loan. Second, you should consider borrowing money from your family or use whatever savings you may have. Third, consider using your personal credit cards. But, and this is a big but, use them with caution because the interest rates for paying late are absolutely exorbitant. Forget a loan or a line of credit if this is your first business. You don't have a track record. And if you don't have a track record, you cannot go to a bank and ask for money. Unless you would be willing to put up some liquid assets, your stocks, your bonds, your CDs, and other cash you may have in the bank. My advice is wait at least a year and then reevaluate where you are in your business. By that time, you should have a much better idea of its potential. I know it's difficult to run a business lean and mean, but the first year, you really want to, lean, to make it as lean as you can. All successful businesswomen have done this, and looking back, they always remember those years. After a year of business, or two, assuming the business is at least breaking even, will lines of credit and loans be available to you? Well, it depends. You may have an opportunity to get a loan, but that loan will be a secured loan, and it'll be a line of credit or loan, whichever works better for you. A secured line of credit or loan, think of the word secure. That's something protected. So a secured line or loan is one where you as the borrower put up something of value to protect the lender's commitment to you. This could be your receivables, your equipment, and in some cases, something you own that is not part of your business, like your home. Now don't go grasping for breath yet. I know many of you consider, as I do, the home to be sacred and untouchable. But if you have a good business and it needs some money to help it grow, and the only way to get a loan or line of credit is to put up your home as collateral, think about it. Have I ever done that? Yes, many times. Was I scared? Certainly. Did I ever lose my home because the bank took it? Absolutely not. If you want to be in your own business, you will be faced with this serious decision at one time or another. My advice to you is make sure you do lots of what ifs. Take a deep, deep, deep breath and then bet on yourself. There are three things you need to take away from this session on borrowing money. One, there are times when you need to supplement your cash and to grow, you must be open to this possibility. Two, not all risk is a dirty word. And three, generally, the best bet you will make in business is to bet on you because no one will know your business opportunities better than you do. The next session, I will be talking about the other side of cash flow, the outflow. So tune in when we flip the coin and look at the other side of cash flow in business.